There's one really significant thing that the emotionally intelligent individual does. The emotionally intelligent never asks themselves the question, why am I so damn happy? And the reason for this is because emotionally intelligent people have figured out that emotions don't have labels. Every single emotion we have is important, valuable information that we need in creating the whole of the picture. They are in tune with all of their emotions and understand them seriously. They understand where they come from, why they are there, the messaging that they're bringing with them, the beliefs that underlie them. They know how to interpret the emotional information to be part of the rational thought process. They also know that when emotions show up, they have strategies to manage them, to regulate them, so the logical brain can stay tuned on. And that logicality around it creates the accurate language to use emotional information in discussion. There's one thing that can happen to a lot of us around our emotional information that many people struggle with and um, fumble around. It's when the inner critic shows up. So our inner critic, or the judge, if you'd like to call them that, shows up when we have not been present in a moment. Because when we're not present in moments, our emotions will get in the driver's seat and they'll start to drive our behavior. And that's when we slip. Now our judge or our inner critic shows up because we've slipped from our path. And their purpose and intention is to show up to remind us, whoa, you're off your path. Get back on your path. This is alignment over here to the person you want to be and are aiming to be, to the person you truly are. And because you were not present in that moment, you let your emotions swoop in and you didn't pay attention to them. And so they drove the bus for a moment and then you behaved in a way that really isn't aligned with your path. The emotionally intelligent treat their judge and inner critic in this manner. They see them as a helper. And what the emotionally intelligent does is they give that inner critic, they give that judge a nod and thank them for realigning them to their path. Individuals who are low in EQ, who are not paying attention to their emotions, when the inner critic shows up, what ends up happening internally is a higher amplified level of shaming and blaming themselves. Not good enough. Made another mistake. How could you do this? And that layering of shaming and blaming does not allow them to regulate the emotion, understand the emotion, and use the emotional information in a positive way to move forward. Instead, they use the emotional information and attach it to strengthening an inaccurate belief system. And so in our growth towards greater levels of emotional intelligence, reframe how you hear the inner critic. Hear them as the voice that realigns you to your path.